Hi, thanks for joining us for our Energise class today. So I hope you enjoy today's class and we'll get started. So we're going to bring those toes apart and those heels apart, so those feet at that hip width distance. So just to start with, we're going to transfer their weight forwards and back, just looking to find that midpoint between those two movements. So that weight's going nice and evenly down through your feet. Fantastic. Knees are nice and soft, not locked back from there. Hands up onto your pelvis. Very gently, we're going to tilt that pelvis forward and then tilting it back. So just a gentle movement forwards and back. Just looking to find that midpoint between those two movements. So that pelvis is in a nice neutral position. So that core is gently engaged. Ribs are soft, collarbones wide, and that neck nice and long and lifted. Fantastic. So we're going to float our hands up to shoulder height, and we're going to start with our toy soldier movement. So we're going to raise one hand and then lower back down. So opposite arm lifted. So just reaching through, keeping those ribs soft. And then we're going to add in our opposite heel raise. So opposite heel raise, and then we're switching. So this kind of toy soldier movement, keeping that pelvis level, that core engaged. We're just warming up through those arms and legs. Just getting those feet working, pushing up through those toes, lovely. Reaching with those arms, lovely. So alternating sides, still breathing in and out here as we're moving through this movement. Fantastic, keep going. Just working through, warming up those joints in our arms and our legs, fantastic. Good, reaching arm, opposite arm, opposite leg. Good, so let's do a few more here, keep going. Lovely, up onto those toes, switching sides. Good, so a little bit of coordination involved in this one as well. Excellent, good. And let's do one more each side. And then back, and float those arms back down, fantastic. So relax those shoulders there. We're gonna warm up our legs a little bit more. So keeping that pelvis nice and level, we're gonna bring one leg just in front. And we're going to flex at this hip, so we're going to flex, and then we're going to reach out to the side. So flexing at the hip, reach out to the side. Now this leg is going to bend with you a little bit, and that's fine, let it do that. We're reaching out to that side, flexing at the hip, reaching away. Good, and reach away. So just really getting those hips working. So lifting up, reaching away, good. Lifting up and reaching away. So keeping that pelvis level, that core still engaged, so I'm supporting my centre as I reach away. Good. Ribs are soft, my neck is nice and long, reach away. Good. Lifting up and reach away. And reach away. Good. A few more here. This leg's working hard as well, supporting you as we're moving the opposite leg. Reach away. Good. One more here. Lift up and reach away. Fantastic, okay. So let's do the same on the opposite side. So we're gonna bring that opposite leg just in front, that pelvis level. This leg again is gonna work hard supporting you. And we're gonna flex at the hip, and then reach it to the side. Flex at that hip, reach to the side, good. Flex that hip, reach to the side, lovely. Reach to the side, good. Lifting up, reach to the side. Keeping that neck long, core engaged, supporting that center. Reaching away, good. This leg is working hard supporting you. Let it bend with you when you reach out to the side. Good, lifting up, reaching away. Lifting up, reach away. Good, few more here. Lift up and reach away. Good, last few. Lifting up and reach away. Good, let's do one last one and reach away, fantastic, back to that centre. Good, so just make sure those feet, maybe just a little bit wider than that hip with distance. I'm gonna go down into some little squats here just to warm up our legs a little bit more. So keep those feet forward, those knees going over those toes, and I want you to imagine you're sitting back behind you, if there's a chair behind you, so your bottom wants to go back when you do these. So take a breath in, as you breathe out, drop that bottom back behind you and lift back up. And again, drop that bottom back and lift up, good. So sitting back behind you and lift up. So just going as low as you feel comfortable. Obviously the lower you go, the harder it is. We wanna make sure we're still keeping that control. Those knees going over those toes and lifting back up. So, so using those legs to push ourselves back up. Good, well done. Now if you can, we can bring those hands in front and back up. So just getting that movement there as well. Good. 
reaching and up. Good, well done. Last few, dropping down and lifting up. Excellent, well done. Dropping down, lifting up. Now if you can, we're gonna drop down this time, we're gonna hold it here. Now either just stay holding it, or we can raise a heel, then the opposite heel. So either just stay holding this if you can, come back up when you need to, or we're just gonna raise, raise each heel, alternating sides, well done. Last few. One more each side. Back to that center and lift back up. Ooh, well done, okay. So bring those feet just a little bit wider and then those feet out to that 45 degree angle. We go down into some side plie now. So take a breath in. As you breathe out, drop down. We're gonna reach one arm up and over, breath in here. As you breathe out, back to that center, hold this position if you can. Opposite arm reaching over, breath in. As you breathe out, back to that center and then lifting back up, fantastic. And again, breath in. As you breathe out, dropping down, reach the arm over, breath in. As you breathe out, reaching over, opposite arm, reaching over, breath in to hold. As you breathe out, back to the centre, raising back up, lovely. Let's do that one more time, breath in. As you breathe out, drop down, reach the arm over, breath in. As you breathe out, back to that centre, last time, opposite arm, reaching over, breath in. As you breathe out, back to that centre and lifting back up. Lovely. Okay, so we're going to do a few roll downs. So come to the end of your mat. So take a breath in. As you breathe out, we're going to tuck that chin down, rolling those hands slowly down towards the floor. Breath in here. As you breathe out, slowly restacking that spine back up into standing. Good. And again, breath in. As you breathe out, tuck that chin down, rolling those hands slowly down towards the floor, breath in here as you breathe out, gently restacking that spine back up into standing. Now we're going to roll down onto four point kneeling now, so breath in, as you breathe out, tuck that chin down, rolling those hands down, then we're going to walk our hands down into four point kneeling and we're going to do some press ups from here. So we've got three options here, either staying in this box position and I'm just lowering my um, hairline down to the mat or feet a little bit further behind you and we can lift lower my breastbone down or if you're feeling strong then you can come up into a full press up so just pick what's comfortable for you and we're going to do eight here so early so we're going to go eight seven six five four three two and one we're going to tuck those toes under again and we're going to roll back up. So tucking those feet under, rolling slowly back up into standing. Reach those hands up towards the ceiling. Good breath in here. As you breathe out, we're going to roll back down and we're going to repeat that again. So rolling those hands slowly down towards the floor, walking those hands down, back up into that press up position. And we're going to pick your level again at those three options. And we're going to do eight more press ups. So, ready? We're going to go eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. And back up. Very good. So, drop down into this child pose stretch. Let's have a stretch out here. So, breathing in and out. On that out breath, if you can, just sink down into that stretch a little bit further if you can. So, breath in. As you breathe out, relaxing down into that stretch, good. And again, breath in. As you breathe out, sink that bottom down onto your heels. Just relaxing down from there, well done. Breath in. As you breathe out, relaxing down here. Good. And we'll come back into four point kneeling. And we're gonna go into our swimming or Superman movement, whatever you like to call it from here. So hands underneath those shoulders. Elbows soft, knees underneath those hips as well. That core is engaged, so just tuck that tailbone under slightly as well. We're going to take a breath in. As you breathe out, we're going to reach one leg behind and then fold back. And we're going to alternate sides, so opposite leg reaching away. Now if that feels enough, stay there. Or if you can, we're going to reach opposite arm, opposite leg, and then fold back. So breathing out as you lengthen away 
and breathe as you land to the back. Good. Reaching away and back. Good. So just really lengthening through that body, but keeping that core engaged. Well done, keeping that back flat. So sometimes we describe, imagine you've got that tray of drinks on your back, you don't want to spill. So keeping that control as alternating sides, lovely. Reaching opposite arm, opposite leg. Very good. Reaching away, folding back. Well done. Excellent. Folding back, last few here. Reaching away, controlling that back. So just keep that line, that neck nice and long. Excellent. Let's do one more each side. And last time. And then folding back. Good. So just dropping that bottom down from here, just relaxing those arms down. And then here we're going to just do a little side stretch. So breath in. As you breathe out, just walk those hands round to one side. Breath in. And as you breathe out, relaxing down here. And again, just walking back to that centre. And this time we're going to walk our hands around to the opposite side. So breath in. As you breathe out, walk those hands around just to add that little side stretch. Breath in. And out here, just sinking down that little bit further. Well done. And then walking his hands back here. Breath in. And out. Very good. So we're going to walk those hands slowly back up. Fantastic. We're going to tuck those toes back under. And we're going to roll back up into standing. So just tucking that bottom under. Restacking back up from here. Lovely. And we're going to just do another stretch here. Stretch out through our side. So breath in. As you one hand down. With this hand, we're going to unzip through that side. Look up towards the ceiling. Look up to that hand. Breath in. And as you breathe out, rolling back down. Good. Start to breath in. As you breathe out, unzip that side. Reach up. Look up to the ceiling. Breath in. And as you breathe out, you're zipping back down. Good. And again, each side. Breath in. As you breathe out, unzipping through that side. Looking up to the ceiling. Breath in. And as you breathe out, Really zipping back down. Lovely. One last time. Breath in. As you breathe out, unzip through that side. Reach up. Breath in. And as you breathe out, back to that centre. Fantastic. And roll those shoulders back down. Fantastic. Great. Well, I hope you've enjoyed the class today just to get ourselves moving. And we we'll hope to see you again.